All right, hey guys, welcome again to Fire Alarms and such, and this is Simplex 4010 Test 29 Vintage ADT. Because I finally got my hands on a Vintage ADT B5009 single action pull station. It's a little worse for wear, but all in all, it looks pretty nice, and I'm glad I was able to finally get one. If we continue going up, we have the System Sensor Spectral Alert Classic 1575 Candela Horn Strobe, and this will be doing Code 3 Electromechanical Horn. If we come all the way across here, then we have another System Sensor Spectral Alert Classic 15 Candela Horn Strobe, and this will be doing Code 3 Mechanical Horn. Coming down here under the stopper with the horn on is a Firelight BG12L Dual Action Push In Pull Down Key Locking Pull Station. We will be smoke testing, or uh, we fog testing the smoke detector with my uh, aerosol smoke. So we'll be doing that today to activate the alarms. Coming over here is a System Sensor uh, L Series horn strobe flashing at 30 candela and code 3 mechanical horn. Coming down here is the uh, Edwards 270 SPOA single action pull down tool reset pull station. So, to begin, I think we will just start with the Edwards station. Here we go. And pull. Sometimes it sticks. We'll go ahead and sounds from the enunciator. These are all on two wire audible silence, so all these strobes are in sync and they all silence on two wires. So we will now get my key ring out and reset the pull station. Please don't mind all the wires. I'm trying to get something pretty cool to work and so far it's not working, uh, which is why there are wires coming out of the wall everywhere around here. So pardon the mess and we'll put a reset in the panel sorry about the door not closing it will occasionally just like there'll be some static between the two magnets and it will stick but like if you just walk by it it will close um so that's why that didn't close until i like breathed on it so now we wait you're probably noticing this is a new switch up here this is what i use to disconnect my id net channel to um change out devices so it is just, it's uh, for a fire suppression system. So this is like a service switch if you want to uh, disable it to do some work on it. So what happens is when you turn the key, the light comes on and then it uh, cuts off my ID net channel. And then all the troubles will start to come up on the panel from weak no answer because it's basically acting as a switch and it just uh, cuts out the system. So that way I can change devices out without completely shutting down the panel and having to reset it every time. Anywho, let's come down to the namesake of the test. This is the ADD B5009 pole station. So let's pull it. Here we go. We'll silence it and we will go ahead and actually reset this. So to reset this you have to unscrew this set screw almost all the way and then the panel slides down. Flip the switch back up. Slide the panel back up and screw the set screw back on. Because the set screw actually is what pulls the, the toggle switch down. So it's only the switch that uh, 
holds the front plate up. And then we will reset. And then we'll go over and do the fire light station once everything resets. I love it when all the strobes are in sync. One in here is doing it too. It's nice. And we wait for the panel to reset. Here we go. So now we can go ahead and pull the Firelight BG12L and the stopper is on. So here we go. Lift, push, and pull. It's a triple action. That's illegal. Here we go. And we can go turn that stopper off. That's so terrible. And we can go ahead and maybe if I get my firelight key, reset the pull station. Rearm the stopper. And close it back up. And then while well, we got the uh, panel alarm, we can do the uh, STI push station. So, lift and push. And we'll go ahead and put a panel Reset in. Grab my STI key. And that is now reset. And we will wait for the panel to reset. You can see we have the two alarms. We have hall, pull, and the stopper. So now we just wait for it to reset. And we are all good and reset. Rats. So, let me grab my can of testing smoke. Once again, we do using the uh, smoke saber, because that's just kind of cool. And then we can go ahead and test it. Here we go. That should be enough. go ahead and do an alarm sounds and turn on the smoke fan through the notifier panel. So um, this has been Simplex 4010 Test 29 Vintage ADD Pole Station. So thank you guys for watching and as always have a wonderful day.